everybody. I'm Ante, nice to meet you. Uh, I work in aeronautic company, which is located in Biograd na Moru. Uh, it's around about 16, 17 miles from Zadar. The location of base is actually very perfect to go uh, on various islands and national parks. Uh, in area of 20 miles, we have two national parks. Uh, regarding one is the uh, National Park Kornati and the other one is Park of Nature Telashti. Over there you have around 300 beautiful small islands, bays where you can anchor or take a buoy and also next to the Kornati Island you have uh, island Dugi Otok on which you have the beach called Sakarun uh, which was pronounced several years like the best beach in the world on which where you, when you are there you can uh, swim on a beautiful white sand and you can watch uh, beautiful sunsets. The next uh, national park we have is National Park Krka. Uh, it's around 30 miles from Biograd and you come to it through sh shallow, uh, not too shallow but narrow cliffs and it's very beautiful to see to come there and then you come to a place Skradin. And from this place, Kradin, you can go with a boat or by foot to see these beautiful waterfalls. And you can walk around the place and see local cuisine. Also, during one week sailing, uh, you have two more national parks which are reachable. These are Mlet and Lasto. And they honestly look like they are not from this planet because they have such untouched nature and beautiful beaches. Regarding the birds and the uh, boys and uh, places in the marinas, uh, Croatian coast is very, very, uh, let's say, islands are very close one to each other, so you can reach any of the island or bird or marina very, very quickly. And to find the place or to get the place, you have two possibilities. Either you can come during high season you can come sooner in the marina to get the place or you can book it by various uh, online softwares where you can reserve your place to be safe you will get it when you come afternoon or when you decide and for this we provide all the info during check-in uh, about the cuisine and meals in Croatia you cannot miss because it's all freshly catched uh, food which uh, people who have restaurants do it in the early morning so that you can get uh, them fresh as, as fresh as they can be and all the restaurants they are they are doing it local so you can feel and, and taste the Mediterranean, Mediterranean uh, Dalmatian uh, taste. Regarding the itinerary, it all depends on your wish, what you would like to feel. So if you want to be just with your family and without too much uh, noise and without a lot of disturbing, the best is to go to national parks or Dugi Otok. Second thing, if you want to party, if you are a young crew and you want to be in the crowd and drink a lot, I don't know, you can go to Hvar, Vis, Novalja, Zrče. And the third one, which also people like to go, you can do historical routes uh, by, by like uh, visiting uh, old uh, cities and old part of cities like Zadar, Trogir, Split, Šibenik where you can see these old buildings, monuments.